Isaiah Sweeney, Demon Senior, getting ready to tip off the basketball season this weekend uh, and start a busy stretch, four games in seven days, beginning Friday night at Texas. You guys have been busy, though. You've had a couple of those secret scrimmages. Mm -hmm. uh, you've got an exhibition game up at Grambling tonight. Uh, how do you feel like the team is uh, shaping up right now? Uh, right now, I feel like we, we're getting better as time goes on. Like, I feel like definitely the Jackson State and the, and the UCA scrimmage helped us overall. Like, we we building our chemistry up and, like, getting a good feel for each other. So I feel like it's, it's really helping us, and we're looking good right now. Now, obviously, you guys have been practicing almost, well, I guess since school started and officially practicing and doing other things since early October. Uh, you've got eight newcomers. How do you blend in that many players and uh, have it going at the start of the season? Uh, I mean, like, I feel like the coaches, they, they've been doing a good job of, like, kind of, kind of like focusing on specific things at one time during practice and then slowly like putting in, putting in like the zone defense and like the, the different schemes that we have. So like I feel like they, they've been take, like they've been really patient with the newcomers and like like as leaders like us uh, returners and veterans like we've been um, we've been doing good at helping out the newcomers too and like like getting them the places that they need to go and like we've been just trying to gel, gel together our um, our, our uh, culture that, that we want to set for this year, which is the winning championship. So, okay, what uh, uh, among these new guys uh, can they all bring something to the court this year? Are they all yeah. guys who are going to be able to contribute? Or are you going to have just uh, uh, some of them are really going to stand out, and some of them going to be role players? Nah, definitely. Like I feel like everybody's going to contribute, especially with the wave system we have, where everybody um, playing their hardest at like at, with their time being out there. So. Yeah, I feel like uh, everybody's going to contribute, and we're, 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 I feel like we're pretty deep this year, too. So. Okay, contrast last year's team to this year's team in style of play. Uh, style of, I feel like we're, we're much faster. We're kind of small, like shorter, but uh, we're faster. And, um, I mean, we, we're, we also move, like, I feel like we've been moving the ball better than last year, and like, like the, the chemistry overall, like on both ends of the floor is, is feeling better. So, uh, You're kind of one of those guys that Coach McConaughey calls a glue guy, uh, and, and one of the major areas you contribute is defensively. Talk about uh, how the Demons are going to be defensively. Uh, well, to win the championship, you definitely have to play defense, and like that's one of the main things that we, we've been focusing on this preseason was um, getting our defense together. So, I mean, we, we're, uh, we're very versatile on the defense end. We can guard. Uh, different positions and I feel like like once we just keep getting better and, and keep uh, improving the defense and we'll we'll be good. All right Friday night you open up against uh, the University of Texas in Austin a team that didn't have a good season last year kind of like uh, the Demons didn't break through like we'd hoped we would. Um, Shaka Smart is their coach obviously there have been times in his past when they've had great success a lot of optimism in Austin. Talk about that opportunity and challenge to go into UT and play. Well, I mean, I feel like the, the opportunity is good. And, like, I mean, like, overall, I feel like we, we should go out there and have fun. And that's the main thing we should look for. And I, I feel like that's, that's going to be, um, uh, like, overall, like, the, the thing we're going to try to get out of that. And it's going to help us uh, to come to conference time since we're playing against the, the higher major, the high major teams. So. Playing a yeah. team that plays their style, which is kind of our style, uh, mm -hmm. is that beneficial? Yeah, it's, it's really beneficial. I mean, we um, it's going to help us get better at what we do by playing that that, that style. And um, I mean, it's really beneficial, and it's going it's going to help us out a lot. So. And then that's the first of four games in seven days. Mm -hmm. um, talk about how you guys are going to. Uh, handle four games in seven days? I mean, we, we're just going to take it one game at a time. And, um, like, I mean, we, we got to get a lot of rest. Everybody got to take care of their bodies and get treatment and all that so we can um, we can play at the best of our ability come those games. But with the system and the rotations, you're set up a little bit better to handle that than a lot yeah. of teams might be, correct? Yeah, we, we can um, get a lot of rest with the, with the waves. And um, I mean, we, it helps us wear teams down. So. That's, that's real good for it. All right, I'm going to try to pin you down. Give me one newcomer to watch. Uh, Zard Perry. What makes him special? I mean, he, he's real fast. He, in the open court, like, he, like Coach Mike say, he's like, it's like trying to catch a rabbit when you uh, 
when you guarding him. So I mean, he's he's real fast. He can shoot, and make plays for others, and he it's gonna be good for us. You ever chased a rabbit? Uh, no, nah, I haven't. Okay. Chase Zara though. <laughs> <laughs> well, don't chase any rabbits. <laughs> no. Thanks, Eli. All right. Appreciate it.